Hello everyone, SimiCraft here, and welcome to another episode of Mario Kart 8 with SimiCraft. Uh, just so you know, today I'll be mixing things up with an inside drifting bike. Uh, generally I use outside drifting, but I figured, hey, let's mix things up. And we have, oh, we, had a f we have a full room of 12 this time. So, yeah, let's get to it. To the races. Alright, F0 has been selected. Oh. Lots of people from the US play at this time, apparently. <laughs> oh, poor Heather. You know you're bad when you're below a thousand. Three, two, one, go. Okay, I perhaps should not have picked an inside drifting bike. Wow. I just finished recording some 200cc videos, and this feels so slow by comparison. And you see, you want to see me do bad? Put me with an inside drifting bike. All right. I wonder what CC does online go at by default? Oh, started that drift way too early. I do not usually use inside drifting. <laughs> like, yeah, I don't use inside drifting, like, ever. Lap three. I wonder what CC does online go at? Does it mix it up? Because this feels especially slow. I'm sure I just came back from doing 200, but I feel like 150 would feel much faster than this, even after doing 200. If my memory serves me right, in Mario Kart 8, like, the types of races changed from race to race, like what CC you were doing. Cause this feels almost like 50 CC. Okay, fifth, top half. Huh. <laughs> yeah, that was really throwing me off the after 200 CC. It felt just, like way too slow. And also with the inside drifting, crazy. No, but if you know what CC the uh, online runs at, why don't you tell me in the comments? I'd really like to know that. Huh. I wonder what we'll get. Cheese land. Ooh. You have someone from Mexico now? That's cool. Oh. 
Hit the banana. And then the green shell. And now I'm in the 11th. Oh man, cool shortcuts. Oh. Come on. Oh, I really should have saved that for a shortcut, shouldn't I? Oh, I took that to in to uh, sharp. Man. There we go. Take that, Scott. Now it's my turn to sh my time to shine. There we go! Alright, I have redeemed myself from that awful F-Zero run. <laughs> Alright. Well, that went well. Just need to wait for everyone else to finish. Alright. That race went well. Cheese, I like Cheese Land. It's a good course. <laughs> Those hang glider shortcuts are amazing. Oh, okay, Baby Park, Wario's Gold Mine, or Cloud Top Cruise. I'll go with Wario's Gold Mine. Ah, oh, this is Retinim. Last game. I like the amount of people we have. It's quite a... It's a large group. Baby Park. Here we go. Prepare for the madness. Scott's in front. Oh, yikes. Oh, that's why they called Baby Park. Ah. Taking corners way too sharp. Just throw it, it'll hit something. I'm sure.
Oh, I need to get an item. This track is all about the items. Okay. Eh, sixth. I'll. Eh, it's fine. I don't have extremely high expectations of myself considering how I'm using an inside drifting bike. So I'll take sixth. Top half, you know. It's alright. And, you know, I got to be that jerk who throws a red shell behind them at the finish line. Let's go for Wild Woods. I like Wild Woods. I've played it once, but I like I liked it when I played it. But this will actually be the last race of the episode. SNES Rainbow Road. All right, bring it. It's not that hard. <laughs> Although I'm using an inside drifting bike, which I never use, so yeah. Quit bumping into me, Bowser. Yikes, all right. Why did I choose Inside Drifting? I didn't need to let you guys know I was terrible at Inside Drifting, because I never do it. Alright. Alright. Made the jump. Alright. What good is a green shell on this track? Uh, will I be able to catch up with their first? Probably not. But it's a good thing to strive for anyways, you know? Should have stopped drifting there. I got a gold mushroom in third place. Ah, not that it actually helped. Nah, Link, come on, man. Oh well, third isn't bad. Anyways guys, that'll be it for this episode. And until next time, I've been Simicraft, and I will catch you in the next episode.